we're here for our monthly favorites. And here I have all of my beauty favorites. And Benji has some not so much beauty favorites. So I'm gonna start off with some drugstore. It's Neutrogena's Shine Control Makeup. This is a newer formula from Neutrogena and um, it was actually recommended that I do a product review first impression and I ended up really liking this product. I have oily combination skin and I find that this just really evens out my skin tone. I wouldn't say it's like the best for like oil control. Um, I would still recommend putting a setting powder at least. For me, I would put a setting powder on my T-zone. But uh, if you want to see the finish, I have a video of this and I really love the consistency of it. What do you think about my face? It looks smooth, right? Mm-hmm. Your nose flared. <laughs> My first July favorites is this um, French tea French press. It's pretty awesome because you can make a single serving of tea with loose leaves and uh, you just put the tea in there, put the water and then you, you press it down. And you can get these at uh, TeaLeaves.com. Okay, my next product is also a drugstore product, and I bought this at Rite Aid. It's Dickinson's Original Witch Hazel. Now, I I remember hearing about Witch Hazel first from Candy Johnson, and just the name of it freaked me out. So I was like, I'm never gonna try that. But lately, with my hormones going crazy, and you know, my <laughs> diet's been changing, my skin's been pretty oily. I can't be using salicylic acid on my face anymore. I usually use Clinique toner um, but it was recommended that I try this and this has actually worked amazing on my skin lately the smell is not so awesome it actually reminds me of some kind of like cooking oil or something smell this honey can you imagine putting that on your face so I almost gagged the first time I put this on but um, I've gone used to it and it's not bad I use it twice a day and um, it really helps with my oily skin uh, my next one is kind of a beauty one it's this Fido Defrizant by the brand Fido, and I used to use this when I had longer hair. It is a hair relaxing balm, a botanical hair relaxing balm that helps your hair from frizzing. I have naturally curly hair, so this mm -hmm. helps it from like frizzing up. Uh, but I like using this even on my short hair because it doesn't leave a really oily residue. Yeah, it is. Oh, I used crazy. to only be able to find it at like nice salons, but I actually found it recently at Sephora. They start selling this stuff. So men, if you want something that's not sticky in your hair, this is stuff. Yeah. But it's expensive. Actually, women use it too. It's not necessarily a men's product. It's cool. It's in a like metal tube too. Does it smell like anything? No. That that's a plus for men. So this next beauty favorite is also a drugstore and ever since the first time I tried this, I fell in love with it. So this is L'Oreal's uh, Lacquer Liner 24 Hour L'Oreal Infallible. So it's from the Infallible collection and it's a gel oh, liner. Infallible. And I've used this almost every single what day. Is that it's for? really intense. Your lips? Really, honey? Really? I don't know, it's infallible. I know that infallible. No, it just means that it lasts long, oh, okay? They have a whole line. Once you have it and you set it, it doesn't smudge or anything. So this is amazing. Set it and forget it? Set it and forget it. And you can also use this on your waterline as well to get that intense smoky look. But I would recommend setting it with um, a black powder. Now this is kind of a surprise. <laughs> this whole wheat organic pasta from Costco. This is made in Italy. I'm surprised by it because when it comes to my pasta, I do not want to mess with it. I think just a straight up regular spaghetti pasta, no healthiness, that's the way to go. Well, I saw this and we're like, oh, let's just try it. Mm -hmm. Organic, whole wheat, very skeptical, okay? Even though I like organic, I don't want my pasta tasting like some, you know, granola or whatever. <laughs> so when we tried this, it was very good. It was delicious. So still on the topic of drugstore, the next is this eye makeup remover. I just ran out of my generic uh, Walmart one and I saw Xtiner talk about this and she swore by it. She's gone through like Xtiner. three bottles. Yeah, Christine. Christine. So Sonia Kashuk's eye makeup remover. It's water-based, it's oil-free, and it removes waterproof makeup amazingly. It's it feels a little moisturizing, but it's not too greasy. I would still wash my face after using this. I remember it was a little pricey mm -hmm. for eye makeup remover, but it still beats like Clinique and Estee Lauder. Oh my gosh. 
The L'Oreal Color Rich, they came out with a new, I don't know if it's Caress or Carice. They're like kind of fancy gold. And these are super moisturizing. They're so shiny. Will that um, stick on me? No. Oh, oh, yeah, 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 it would. Oh. It's not one of those long-lasting lipsticks where you could wear it and then you could eat and then it'll could still be on there. kiss me and what? It, it would transfer. Oh, no. So it's one of those that you'd have to just reapply. But I just love the color. I love the consistency. Why would you even wear that knowing you're going to kiss me? It's going to Can't work. you get a color in infallible? And it that smells would work? so good. It smells like mamba candy. Doesn't that smell like mambas? Really great for summer, and I think this would be great for winter too because when your lips get dry, it's super moisturizing. My last favorites for July, it kind of goes along with my pasta. Trader Joe's organic tomato base spaghetti sauce, mushroom flavored. This is amaze balls, and we've been using it. Mm -hmm. Grampy, I'm sorry, I haven't been using, you know, <laughs> making my pasta sauce from scratch. But this is a great substitute and Judy loves mushrooms so you know I put in so many flavorings after this that sometimes I feel like I don't know what the taste of this is but I can tell you I love it. So this one I've gotten so many compliments every time I wear this. Doesn't it look pretty classy? It actually kind of is Chanel inspired design. It looks expensive. It looks super expensive but this is cheap. I'm actually affiliated with this company called Just Fab. They sell purses, tons of shoes. I think they started off in shoes and also accessories. I saw a commercial about them. So everything on the website is $39.95 and actually right now I believe I saw that they're having a promotion. If if you sign up now uh, for the first time, then you could get two items for the price of one. So two for $39.95, which is an awesome deal. So my style, I'm actually, I consider myself a little classy. Um, I don't like Diva. anything too bold or like I don't like too many studs. Diva. Like They have a bunch of cute styles, a lot of, you know, uh, things that are in right now. But I like stuff that will kind of be timeless and this was oh definitely oh one now of you're them. using my term huh a timeless oh sorry timeless? did you did you trademark no, that term you, you made fun of me for using it and now you're using okay. it okay mm -hmm. so here's what it looks like it has a cute little tassel in the front i love the handle now what you can do is actually you can use it as a you know over the shoulder like this so it actually it hangs kind of low i don't know if you would like that but i like to wear it like this. It has this right here in the shoulder so that it's not pulling and hurting your shoulder when you wear it to the side. But the tassel is super cute. It's sleek. It has the gold chain. I love it. And then inside, it's just really simple. It just has um, the pocket inside. In here, I usually just put like my lipsticks, my lip glosses, makeup, and then my wallet and such in the main part. The only thing that I have noticed that does bug me about this bag is that because the chain is on the actual um, opening, what do you call this, flap of the bag, when I leave the bag open and I have it on, the stuff inside kind of weighs it down so it hangs like this. So I always have to make sure I close it all the way before I go on with my day. So that thing is kind of like a hassle because I'm used to just letting things stay open, but um, just wanted to mention that. I think it's cute. Very timeless. Is that timeless? I think it's timeless. Ah. Chanel style. Ah. Oh, and because it is a subscription website, you pay $39.95 a month, but you can always skip if you didn't find anything you like. So it's not like you're obligated to, um, they're not going to take money out of your account every month if you don't find anything. So FYI. So my very last favorite of the month is my Clarisonic Plus. Now this one I've had for years. I want to say three years now. But I stopped using it the past year and a half or so because I was like, you know, my skin's pretty good. And then I got pregnant and then my skin was like, whoa, Nelly, Judy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so even Benji noticed. He's like, babe, you need to take care of your skin. So that's when I pulled this out. This will do the job. And Did I've been it? using it? it for like the past two weeks. And my skin has improved immensely. Like I used to have like huge whopping zits, like, like the zits that hurt. Like here it's, it's going away and then there's one up here, but they've been diminishing after I've been using this. It's not one of those that will work like the very next day. It probably takes two weeks to 
for you to notice the difference. You can actually take this in the shower with you. So every time I shower, I use this and it's timed. Like I have a, I don't know if I have a video on this, but it's, ooh. But it's timed, so it tells you how long to use a brush and where to use it. I don't know, it's pretty amazing. Uber expensive, but I think it's worth every single penny. Comment below or post a video response of your favorites of this month. I love watching favorites videos whenever yeah. I'm in the bathroom getting ready or she just does. in the morning or doing she's my makeup. A poo I always, yeah, going wow. In the bathroom. Well, you do. <laughs> <laughs> she has to take it in there. It's, it's like I am always toilet paper on and a laptop. Talk to you later. Bye. Bye. Okay guys, I know I'm not alone here. I'm sure you take your cell phone in the bathroom with you and you're watching your videos, reading your tweets. Come on now, back me up here. <laughs> but anyways, if you want to see more beauty videos, click the video on the left where I show you a really hot and sexy Selena Gomez inspired hairdo. Or if you're into daily vlogs, check out my vlogging channel, It's Judy's Life. Click the video on the right. Did I zoom it up? No, you can't zoom it up because it's not on autofocus. Cover your face for a second. It's not on autofocus. Oh, why? Why? I told you because it kept going back and forth. Oh. Try this out. This is L'Oreal. What are you doing? Is it autofocused? Because. What else you got? Is this gonna be on your favorites? Too? It is, yeah. Do your own favorites! I only have one more. <laughs> don't, don't! This dress is kind of see through. I didn't even notice that. Awesome. <laughs> You're such a creepers. <laughs>